And we are live, guys. Uh, 17 March 2023. Football manager stream today. We have two streams. Uh, later on, we're going to have the betting league on again. Welcome. Uh, let's, um, let's start, guys. Let's not waste time. Let's begin. Today, season number 12. We are starting a new, new road. Last season we survived and we actually finished 10 with Bordeaux in Ligue 1. This season we have a very, very, very good start, very strong start. And we are hoping to finish top 6. This is the main, main target for the club. I hope you are having a good day, whatever you are. And let's have some fun. Since the last stream... Um, I played friendlies, as you remember, uh, we lost 2-1 against Sevilla at home after a strong win against Benfica. All games were played at Madmut Atlantique and we um, managed to get two more great, great results. 2-1 uh, win against Dortmund at home and 3-0 also Ajax, guys, big wins which uh, made me believe that we're gonna have a very good season we started with 4 nothing away at Nantes I'm gonna show you the goals uh, Alexander Shadrin our new backup striker scored and Daniel Mehic our new shadow striker on the score sheet with two goals also Becky Tam the fourth goal actually the fourth goal was scored by Shadrin Becky Tam scored the third one but yeah let's see the highlights So this is the very first uh, game of the season in league uh, away at the new promoted uh, Nantes. This is the first goal scored by Mehic after a beautiful finish, of course. Uh, and then second goal came from a pass uh, from assist from Ronaldo and Mehic with a beautiful chip, two nothing. Mehic here with across in the box and uh, Becky Tam uh, takes advantage of a central defender mistake there from Nantes and the last goal came in the 83rd minute Kaufrie with a cross and goalkeeper goalkeeper error Shadrin is there to take advantage also and 4-0 first three points of the season for us hey pixel welcome to the stream man yeah, uh, I don't have a schedule anymore, to be honest, um, because I can never be on time. So uh, it's because of my gym and like the the field there that they, they can't they can't have a steady steady schedule. So I have to depend on them. Whenever they uh, let me know the field is available, I have to go and train, and then you know. But every single day it's gonna be before 12 p.m. Uh, Central Time. So whenever we're gonna have streams it's gonna be uh football manager is gonna be before 12 p.m all the time and of course betting stream is gonna be after afternoon i hope you have a good day pixel thank you for joining man yeah let's see the second game at home against monaco huge win unexpected to be honest uh, monaco is i think in my uh, in my opinion the second team in France after Paris Saint-Germain. Yeah, thank you, Pixel. Thank you for, for making it today, man. I know you guys have a busy schedule also. So, you know, the main uh, t the main purpose of this channel is uh, football manager streams, guys. That's why um, yesterday on the betting stream, I said, uh, yeah, I don't know if you were, uh, if you were online when I told the guys... Um, if you if you decide to have a betting betting day you let me know and i'll be more than happy to stream it you know but it's it's very unpleasant for me when i when i do the betting stream and i talk by myself you know so yeah this is pixel with the second goal guys pixel scored against monaco 
FM Lion here on the right, passing to Aliu. Aliu in the box, and look at this finish right here. Our new central midfielder from uh, um, Aarhus in Denmark. Delap scored also in the 48th minute for Monaco. Great striker. Our third goal in a 50th minute. Nare passing to FM Lion. FM Lion to Pixel. And from a deflection, Pixel scores his second of the game. And uh, yeah, that, actually that was the fourth goal. So yeah, 4-2 win at home. Two games already played, guys. Uh, we are traveling to Sochaux for the next one. We have uh, no updates for the roster. We have the same players. Uh, we promoted Haidar Olgun from uh, the second team because we need bodies. So this guy is a decent, decent backup. Not great, but you know, whenever we have injuries, he's gonna get some playing time. We're gonna give a face, give him a face a little later. Carlos Abad also not so good, 19 years old, you know, 84 current ability, but we need bodies, guys. Uh, our our bench is not strong, I can tell you that. Oh, you have a friend going to Chicago tonight? Okay. Well, tell him it's not, it's not, uh, it's not uh, warm here. It's a pretty pretty chilly. So he needs uh, he needs a thick jacket. No, no. Uh, I live far away from from downtown. I saw it on TV though. On TV they showed um, they dyed the, the the river green. Oh, she's from Michigan. Okay, <laughs> she's used to this. So yeah. We have one week until Sosho. We need the players to um, to get some rest. It wasn't an easy game against Monaco, even though we scored four goals. Um, our energies are low now. We need to recoup. So far, so good. Uh, our defensive department is um, doing pretty well. And now, of course, uh, our attackers are just destroying everything. Eight goals in two games says it all uh let's see bordeaux announced season tickets twelve thousand two hundred season tickets not bad i mean could be better better than nothing all right so we couldn't register eric nzaba for the first part of the season because he's still 15 years old and the rule in france is that you if you have uh, players under 16 uh, they're not uh, gonna be able to play they're not gonna be able to be registered for professional football so you need to wait until they turn 16. so this guy uh, eric nzaba is gonna turn 16 in september we have to wait yeah i remember stoichkov great player great great player he uh, was uh, playing with haji at barcelona both of them they were unstoppable and uh, soichkov uh, won the ballon d'or one time which is a uh, which is impressive for a bulgarian player you know very impressive So let's go and check Jules Petrosian, guys. I'm monitoring uh, the situation at Jules every single week. We are trying to see if we have a chance to go back. Uh, they are ninth in the Superliga. They already played four games, guys. They're not doing good. Four games, they have two wins and two losses. They're not doing good. As soon as this job is going to be available, we are going to go back. And I found a way to beat that glitch, guys. So even if we're going to have in the future, even if we're going to have that glitch available, we are still going to be able to uh, we are still going to be able to play European football. 
So what I'm thinking is if we're gonna have the glitch again, I will schedule friendlies for the whole season. Like 30 34 friendlies on top of the uh European games. So it's gonna be pretty much a whole season of games. So we don't have to quit, we don't have to go to other teams, we don't have to sign with other clubs. We're gonna stick to Gio. But from what I'm, from what I know right now, uh, this glitch happened after 10 seasons in charge. So I'm, I'm counting that after 10 more seasons, we're gonna have it again. So give and take, you know, probably uh, by uh, November in real life, uh, you know, when the FM24 is gonna come out, we're gonna have, uh, we're gonna win the Champions League with you. So fingers crossed. Let's hope. We're going to be able to, to go back. Yeah, we're going to schedule all kinds of friendlies, Pixel. Uh, you started second... Uh, you started season uh, one season ago with Bordeaux. So, 2030... Let's see here. 2032-2033 season. So yeah, uh, I still have a save uh, with Jules Petrosciani right before the glitch happened. But st since like we already signed with Bordeaux and we already went one season in and we kind of rebuilt the club, uh, it feels weird to go back and uh, and do, you know, re redo a whole season of friendlies with Jules. So let's keep it real. Let's keep going. And if Jules' job is available, we're going to jump on it and go back. I contemplated on it, but it kind of feels... It feels weird, you know, to go back one year. Yeah, well, um, Batsmurf and Schmilios are not at the club right now. We can't afford them. Only you. You are the main striker, Pixel. We cannot afford to buy momentarily uh, Schmilios and Batsmurf. They, um, they ask for too much too much money on on uh, salaries and also their club they uh, they want them they need them so hopefully in the future our board is gonna make some funds available so we can we can buy them you know definitely <laughs> managers <laughs> yeah well we'll see <laughs> but definitely I'm gonna try uh, to bring you a jewel because you are gonna grow a lot um the only the only attribute that i don't like is finishing but for some reason you are scoring tons of goals so you already scored two goals in two games in the league but in friendlies though in friendlies you scored six goals in four games and against top top teams as you can see here we had only hard games benfica sevilla dortmund ajax you scored against Benfica 2. Let's see. Against Sevilla, you scored 1. Against Dortmund. Against Dortmund, you didn't score. But you scored 2 against Ajax again. You No, 3 against Ajax. Patrick against Ajax. Oh, right, right, right. Player and manager. Right, let me check. Let me, let me double check here. But I think, I think so. Information. Yep, favorite personnel. <laughs> Adrian Greco, head coach. I'm number one. Patrick against Ajax, yes. So yeah, your full name is John Jamie Benitez, but uh, aka Pixel. <laughs> yeah, so... Like I said, as soon as Geo job is available, I'm gonna take you with me. Um, look at the physicals though. This is impressive. The physicals are... And your potential is through the roof. Let's go reports. Good League, league 1 player. But definitely you will um, improve in the future. Still plenty of room to improve. And we're working on shooting right now for you. There was a great JJ in Atletico Nacional. Jota Jota Tres. Oh, okay. <laughs> Your JJ. 
JJ Benitez. <laughs> and uh, the only thing is that you played for America de Cali. But it's okay. Let's see. So last season you scored 5 goals in 23 games. This season you scored already 2 goals in 2 games with 7.90 average rating. So I guess you feel better as a advanced forward. As a left, uh, as a inside forward, hmm. Yeah, I mean, you did decent, but here as an advanced forward, it's... You're unstoppable right now. Three is. Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it looks like uh, Karambe, if you remember Karambe. He played for a bunch of big teams, especially Real Madrid, the French player, Christian Carambe. So yeah, I'm planning to stream today until, uh, what time is it? 12... Until 2 o'clock, guys. So another 2 hours we have, um... We have plenty of time to... To make some, um, some damage here. We have Sochaux, we have Saint-Etienne and Strasbourg. So definitely we can pick up more points here. Let's see, we have an offer for Casado. Man, come on. What are we doing here? Is this amateur hour? Like uh, the great Will Ferrell said once. Uh, reject, of course. So yeah, uh... Even though it's going to be so, so difficult to leave this uh, club, Girondin de Bordeaux, which I'm starting to become a fan now. <laughs> uh, yeah, Gilles' job is... Yeah, it's too tempting. Too tempting. And I have plans for the future, because Gilles has money now. They they sold everyone, so they have a very, very good financial situation. They sold every big player that I brought to the club and now uh, we have to rebuild everything from nothing because whatever they got they're just junk players that the AI computer chose to sign so we need to uh, dominate again that uh, that league and then uh, bring back I mean not bring back but bring in some wonder kids for the future and definitely I will be uh, favored always to take the job in front of other coaches because I number one reason is I am from that city and second I'm a legend of the club We're getting closer to the transfer window deadline. We're not doing any deals anymore. We're done. Now uh, we are looking forward for the winter transfer window. Where we are hoping that our chairman is going to make some funds available. Uh, the finances are looking okay now. Uh, we got some money from the TV rights. Uh, I think it was around 27 million. 27 million from the TV rights in France is not a joke, guys. So yeah, let me see here. So now we have uh, seventeen million five hundred twenty thousand eight hundred seventy-two dollars in the bank account. We're we're over the budget on wages, but that's uh, I'm not worried about that. That's gonna be covered very soon by the board. Yeah. So increase payroll. Let's see here. We're gonna ask now for the payroll to be increased, and if we have money. Maybe we're going to make a, a loan move or something because we need bodies. If not, we're going to wait for winter. 
Hey Bessmer, what's up man? Welcome to the stream. We got probably uh, a week and a half to uh, make some moves. But like I repeat myself now, we need to wait and see if the chairman is going to give us some money for wages or transfers, you know. I'm good, man. I'm just... Uh, Trying here to uh, to see if we can sign more players before the window is gonna shut down. We need more more bodies. We need probably two three loans, but that all depends on the chairman if uh, he can give us some some cash. So yeah, I don't know if Shimilios already um, saw the games for the betting stream. But we need his picks though, so I don't know. I don't know how we're gonna manage to... Did he post the picks or no? Let me, let me double check. Well, yes he did, okay. Okay, we got we got his picks. So yeah, we're gonna start 2.30 today, guys. Two thirty, the betting stream. So today I will uh, keep the stream info as football manager. Well, uh, while we are gonna bet, let's see if we're gonna have more viewers. Uh, let me double check pixel. Today's pick. Uh, <laughs> mm, uh, Valladolid Bilbao. Uh, that's, that's a good one. Although it's risky, it's a good one. You, we already know pixel, you go for risk bets, so nothing new. <laughs> And uh, the only one that it might be, might not gonna hit is uh, Newcastle and Nottingham because Newcastle, they, usually they don't score go a lot of goals. So yeah, they, what I'm thinking is they're gonna control the game, they might squeeze a win, or it's gonna be a tie, this is what I'm thinking. But over 3.5 goals is kind of a stretch. But again, Pixel, don't listen to me. I'm not an expert. Anything can happen. The ball is round. So, you know, uh, good luck to you. And let's see. Maybe you're going to win again. You're doing great. 26 points after eight, day eight days. Not bad. Okay, let's, uh, let's ask the board here. I'm desperate for more flexibility in the payroll budget. We can't afford to pay everyone what they deserve. And we're running a huge risk of losing blah, blah, blah. I would appreciate a bigger bankroll budget to keep our pl best players here. All right. <coughs> All right. So they don't want to give me anything. Rivals. Let's see. Ah, come on. The lack of ambition. We reject that notion. This is really important, man. Yes! Boom! Boom! They give me more money for the wages. Let's see. After four 
four tries. I insisted for four times in a row. And they decided to say yes. What a great guy. Francois Roussel. Alright, let's see now. How much? How much? And this guy is not bad. Bernardo Rosa. Oh, come on. That's nothing, dude. So they gave me just enough to cover the... Um, the wages that we were over. Ah, oh, man. Can we ask for... Uh, Oh, yeah. Increased transfer budget. Come on. But definitely we're going to have money for some loans, guys. So this is good. We're going to have at least uh, two loans. Money for two loans. Have a great relationship with the chairman. And I, ha I have a new strategy for, for bets, guys, that uh, is starting to, to hit. Um, also, it's four bets per day. You have a set bankroll, but you're looking at odds, like uh, at games with odds very, very close to each other. Like, for example, Sochaux versus Bordeaux. Sochaux plus 150, Bordeaux plus 160, right? And you always do double chance. You do home to win or tie. And I'm telling you, it's it's hitting really, really good. I'm making profit with that strategy. Only those games, you have to search for those odds very uh, close to each other. Yep, I'm gonna do both of these strategies. So Paris Saint-Germain tied Marseille 2-2 away. Okay, so we're one point behind Paris. If we beat Sochaux now away, we are gonna be top of the league, guys. If you can believe it. Nope, only home. You bet only on home team or tie. So double chance home or tie. And it's hitting at, like right now, it's hitting at almost 99% for me. Two days in a row. Th oh no, three days in a row. I uh, I won. I lost only one bet in three days. So. But you have to look for those odds. Like really close odds. Plus. You don't go for minus, you just go for plus. Plus uh, 150, plus 160, it doesn't matter, you know. They have to be very close to each other. Because if uh, if the value is very close between the teams, the home team has the advantage most, most of the time because of the fans, because of, you know. And if something bad happens, at least they're going to tie. But very, very... Um, almost... Uh, <laughs> You know, the, the away team is uh, almost never winning. So in this kind of situations, you're going to have bad beats once in a while. But overall, guys, this is a good strategy. It doesn't, uh, they don't have to be close favorites. Like, for example, they can be underdogs and play it at home. Let's say underdog team plus 160. Uh, let's say uh, B uh, Borussia Dortmund plays Bayern, right? Borussia plays at home. Borussia has plus 160. Bayern has plus uh, 150, 140 to win, right? So you play Borussia or tie. It's an example because we know in real life Bayern will will probably win, but I'm trying to kind of show you, you know, 
the way this strategy works. It's it's doing wonders for me. And yes, Pixel, I saw the the draw, man. Um, I think uh, City City is gonna go through. I think City is gonna beat Bayern. I know, I know. Uh, you, I'm telling you, Bayern. Um, they lost a lot of of their value uh, when Lewandowski left. So Bayern is weaker than last season. Yeah, check it out, Betsmurf. For me, it's working. So search for those uh, odds, and oh, of course, of course, check also the teams and uh, the league standings, right? But mainly, you have to focus on the odds, because the odds are the way. Uh, I don't know how to express myself. So when you look at the odds, you see exactly how the sports book is thinking about that game. So they tell you what they're thinking about the game. So you pretty much you do exactly what they tell you. <laughs> Tie or win for the for the home team. They're telling you that game is must is very close. So they, they're thinking it's going to be a tie. This is what they're thinking. It's going to probably be a tie or very close uh, favorites, uh, the home team. So for me, it's a no-brainer. I don't know why I didn't, I didn't think about this strategy before. And for the first time, this is not <laughs> a strategy that I found online. I actually thought about it and was like, ah, let's, let's see how this is going to work. And I checked it out uh, with uh, one dollar bets, you know. I said like, ah, let's test it out. Let's not throw like real, real money until uh, I know for sure it's gonna work. Ah, they don't want to give me more money, but whatever. Alright, so now we can go and scout. We have some money available. Who is this guy? Left back Julian Eitenshek. Hmm. 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 Look at this guy. But we already have two left backs though. But it's it's good to keep it in mind. 18 years old, M M Michael Rusilio. Italian. Oh my god, this guy is, is a beast. Dude! Ho, 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 ho. And we're gonna loan him. We are gonna loan this dude. Loan. He's so reasonable too. Let's see. Yep. 875 all right end of the season optional future fee fine we're gonna give you star player uh, yes boom this guy is awesome man awesome michael rusillo are you kidding me flare 17 Jumping, eh, we don't need jumping. 16 technique, 15 pace, 15 dribbling, 15 first touch from Inter Milan. Look at the potential here. <laughs> 129 current ability at 18 years old. This guy is a wonder kid. This guy is a wonder kid, guys. Michael Rusillo. So now we're gonna move FM Lion. Um, actually. FM line is gonna be a backup to this guy now. Yeah, this guy got to be the starter now. Interlad, yep. This guy is a beast. So yeah, FM line is gonna be the backup. And uh, Pixel, we're gonna fight for the spot, man. You and me, we're gonna fight for the advanced forward spot now. Who is uh, in a better form is gonna play. And we promised to be a uh, starter, like us, like us, yeah, starter. 
let's see here so definitely he's gonna say yes we are lucky because our chairman gave us a little more room in the wages So yeah guys at two o'clock we're gonna stop and uh, i need half an hour to to write down the games for uh for today for the betting stream and uh again uh we can't i i can't uh be sure when i'm gonna stream every day like i said uh, the schedule is gonna be weird so the fm stream is gonna be always always before anytime before 12 p.m central time so it can be 9 30 it can be 10 30 11 30 but because i have you guys on discord you don't need to worry you're gonna get a notification there whenever i'm online so no 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 uh, not enough money best smurf but i'm gonna try as soon as i tried to ask the board for more money for transfers they uh, said no they only gave me a little money for wages to cover because we were uh, we were negative on uh, on the wage department in the winter definitely uh, they will give us more money because um, when we started the season we got 27 million from the tv rights in league and they, they give you 27 million for the tv rights so that's a lot of money Salernitana for Casado. No, get the hell out of here, man. Man, I lost yesterday on on freaking Arsenal, dude. My only pre-bet that I lost yesterday. I won three, I lost one, and the, the one was Arsenal. But what a goal from that guy from Gonzalez. Oh my god. What a goal. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna double. I didn't check yet, but I will check right now. I'll check right now. Best Smurf. Let's see here. Um, let's go to last season. Oh no, this is a different way. There's a different way. Transfers, transfer history. Yes. Bad Smurf. Where is it? Bad Smurf right here. So you're back with Lillestrom. Four games, one goal. 668. So I guess you're a starter now for Lillestrom. Let's see the tactics. Yeah, you are playing as a forward now. Advanced forward. And you have my number, 21. Oh, man. <laughs> How dare you to steal my number? I'm joking. <laughs> Nicola Staller. I have this. I had this guy at Gio, Nicola Staller. Are you kidding me? For one season, 2.5 million. We got him from Bodo Glimt. He's still playing. Still going strong. Best Murph is Lillestrom's new advanced forward, guys. Okay, let's go and check Schmilios. Back with Valerenga. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can I, can I loan you guys? Let's see, loan. Oh, right. Boom! Hold on a second here. 
Because we are gonna probably... Let's see how much money we have. 25, 24... Man, we're right there. We are right there. Okay, so... Uh, what am I doing, man? Okay, transfer history. We might... We might pull this move, guys. Loan. Ah, see? Are reluctant to allow this player to leave on loan due to the first team. So they actually want you... You're the starter for them. They don't have other striker. Yeah, Romario. But for Schmilios... For Schmilios, maybe we can pull... A move here. Four seventy-five. So they will uh, sell sell uh, Milios for two point five. Let's do optional. Two point five. End of the season. Three point five. How about three? All right, fine. So maybe we can bring back Schmilios, guys. But best Smurf, definitely we have to buy you. Otherwise, they don't let you on loan, man. But now, definitely Schmilios is going to agree to sign for us. Offer accepted. All right, now we need to we need to sell we need to sell somebody so we can bring that wonder kid too. Let's see who we got. Who we got? We got no one. Jose Chalo. Can we sell Chalo? Chalo. Okay, let's ch let's sell Chalo. Um, let's do one million. All right, before we start the game at the show, we need to tr check the training levels. We are doing great so far, guys. We have a huge chance to become the league leaders in front of Paris Saint-Germain in our third game, third week of Ligue 1. And loud noises from uh, from Petrosciani. That uh, they might fire their coach. Two losses in four games. They're not doing good. They're not doing good. I cannot wait for them to, to fire their coach. No, in the game. <laughs> in real life, they just hired a new coach, dude. Uh, former player. Uh, they will comfortably stay in uh, the third division this season but for next next year uh, i don't know i don't know if they're gonna survive because they have no money uh i don't think the players are paid right now i think most of the players are on an amateur contract they can't afford to uh to pay the players anymore this is how bad it is so as soon as they're gonna get offers for any player they can go for free uh i would gladly go there and fix their uh, situation. <laughs> it takes me. It's gonna take me a few seasons, but definitely, I'm gonna do a great job. I'm gonna take you guys. Uh, I'm gonna take uh, Basmurf as my assistant, and you Pixel are gonna you're gonna play because you're young, dude. You're 22. So let's go to Petroshan, guys. All right. So let's check for additional trainings. Ball control. Pixel endurance now. Hatling, Chalo, Becky Tom, Nare, Lacoste, Aliu, Carlos Abad, Daniel Mehic, endurance for Walter Perez. 
Oh yeah, Pixel. You will be the the best player in the team by far. Like we're looking at your numbers at Bordeaux, man. Like, come on. It's gonna be a joke to play for you. They're gonna wait for you at the airport, like, you know, with uh, the red carpet. <laughs> <laughs> Like uh, Galatasaray waited Falcao at the airport. Galatasaray fans waited. I watched the video. My God, they, it was insane. Falcao couldn't even breathe. Flowers and confetti and everything. Unbelievable. <laughs> so yeah, it's kind of it's gonna be kind of the same thing. And me and Basmer, we're gonna be right there. The, the staff that's gonna that's gonna bring the club into Champions League for the first time in the history in real life <laughs> because in this save I, I think five times in a row we qualify for no not in a row I'm lying three times in a row but five times overall we uh, we qualify to Champions League all right so we are ready guys to play so show away Everybody is rested. Everybody looks great. We're going to keep the same lineup that uh, we uh, played against uh, Monaco. Salvador, Tom, Ronaldo, Nare. Yeah, we're looking great. And Herman, dude, this guy has a great season so far. I know his attributes are going to go a little low now. It happens with every player. They're going to go up in, in the future for sure bright bright future for this uh, for this guy could improve a lot oh yes herman i'm playing on the right let's see this guy learned okay so this guy is gonna be our new right back if we sell chalo i know he, he looks horrible 23 years old but we have to we have to have someone. What? Team Cohesion poor? Wait a second. How come? Team Cohesion poor. Because we we got some new players maybe. But the tactics are looking great. Alright Pixel. I'll be here man. Alright let's start guys. Live. We're playing our... Third game of the season at Sochaux, guys. Make me proud. Kick off. Let's go. We gave number three to Ronaldo, Cristiano Ronaldo. He's the vice captain, and Ingezana is the new captain. Ayala passing to. Higita and Son Sen again. Great save there. Come on, boys. Yes, steal. Pixel and corner kick, but what a shot by Pixel. Very aggressive. Immediately with his first, first big chance. Come on, boys. We need the three points here. So Nice is first now. Nine points. Come on, come on, come on. Aliu! What was that? Oh! Pixel 
diving in the box there and counter attack for Sosho now Ronaldo is putting some pressure on oh Golazzo for Pixel. Huge mistake by the social defender. Oh my god, and Pixel stole that like a snake again. Jesus, what a bad pass. Look at this. Pedro back pass to the goalie, but Pixel was quicker and scored this beautiful goal here. 1 0 for Bordeaux away at Sochaux, guys. Great start of the season. Hands down, the best start that we, we had so far. Another chance here. one nothing. Pixel scored the opener. Let's see here. Pixel again on the right. On the right, he turns. Passing to Mehic. Blocked shot there. So Pixel scored three goals in three games in uh, League and this season. Unstoppable. Too bad he's not here to to see. Uh, Higita and over the over the bar. Becky Tom six point four and yellow card. We need to make sure he's not gonna get a red. Probably we're gonna sub him at halftime. Come on, boys, we need to keep it going. Yes, tackle. But don't get the yellow. One more goal, and I think we're gonna put this game to sleep. Easy. Cruze. Post, but offside. Come on, Gironde. Aliou post oh. <laughs> This is the the target this season guys Europe This season we're going to Europe So we got 8 point something, 8.5 million for uh, finishing 10th in the league last season and another 27 million for from the TV rights. So 37 million, uh, actually, yeah, 35 million total. Oh, oh, Pixel, Pixel, Pixel. Ah, bad angle. We're just waiting for the chairman to give us more money now. And then we can buy back Bad Smurf. We are negotiating with Chmelios now for another loan. And Becky Tom has to be sub definitely. 6.3. And Ronaldo yellow card. Yes, another steal there in the middle. Pixel passing for the Lion. Mehic! Mehic! Go! Uh. Another goal, guys. 2-0 before halftime. Lucky goal, but I don't care. It's gonna. It's a deflection from the defender after Daniel Mehic, Mehic had a 1-on-1 -on -one chance with the goalie. 2-0. Nice. <laughs> I had so much faith in this guy. And he shows that I was right. And no offside. Come on. Pixel, you scored again, man. Three games, three goals. Unbelievable. And uh, right now, I think we are top of the league. If you can believe this. Come on, boys. Let's uh, keep it going. 2 nothing is a dangerous score. Captain Lion. 
Imagine if that wonder kid from Inter is joining. Oh my god, dude. Lion. Ah. Salem. Becky Tom. Oh yeah, we need to change Becky Tom though. Hold on a second. L uh, right after this highlights. Let's see Ingezana. Pixel. Pixel with a blocked shot. The goalie with another mistake. Lion. Uh, what was that? Why was that in counterattack now for Sosho? Let's steal it. Steal it. Yes. Salvador is our Lisandro Martinez, guys. Very short central defender, but he's he's really good. Alright, so let's take out Becky Tam. We'll put Brown in. Ronaldo Mehic. Peter Brown, Australian central defender. Come on, come on. Ronaldo, Herman, Brown, Salvador. Passing to Aliu. Aliu for Pixel. Pixel for Herman. Post. Oh my god. Pixel with a beautiful assist. Champagne football, guys. Herman 6.4. We're gonna monitor him probably. We're gonna move in Gezana. Yeah, let's move in Gezana and uh, bring in Perez. Let's see here. All right, so in Gezana, we'll bring in Perez for Herman. Alright, and Aliu is kind of tired, so battling for Aliu. Wait, what a team. And who is first? Bordeaux, guys. Look at the league standing right there. I know it's just for a while, but I like it. <laughs> Ungezana penalty. What? What? No penalty. All right. Thank you. I thought it's a penalty, man. Don't you think? Like, it was from behind. Come on, boys. Come on. Ronaldo. 12 more minutes. 12 more minutes. Pixel. There you go, hot link. I like that guy. Ah, uh, offside. Offside. Thank you. Five more minutes. Salvador, Nare, FM Lion. Long pass for Ungezana. Ungezana passing to Pixel. Ooh. Man. Very close to being 3 nothing. Ah. Salvador, too short, too short. <laughs> Ronaldo with the throw in. Rui Hatling. Ronaldo again with the cross. FM Lion uh, over the bar. Not a bad header. 90th minute, let's do some more subs, guys. Just for the time wasting. Lacoste for Nare. 
Tafie for Ronaldo. And that's it. Nare, Hatling, Pixel, Salvador, switches to Ronaldo, 91st minute guys, 3 minutes of extra time, Ingezana in the box, Ingezana for Hatling, nope, Nare, Hatling now, block shot, come on Brown, don't let him, don't let him get, get away. Salem and Ronaldo trying to help the defense here and go. Wow, 2-1. As soon as I put the backups in, we allowed one goal. Let's not, let's not waste this opportunity to get three points here. All right, so I guess this is full time any moment, ref. Any moment, any moment, I said. Pass it and shoot it away. Yes, Kaufie, pass, pass. Ngezana, Ngezana, come on. Whatever, it's over. Three points. There you go. Beautiful job by the players. Nice work, everyone. Mission accomplished. And we are top of the league. Next is Saint-Etienne at Manmuta Atlantic in front of our fans, guys. We have Strasbourg away, another doable, doable game, and then Marseille at home, another clash. We remember we beat Monaco, so like I said, we're not a joke anymore in France, guys. Oh, Chalo, oh, oh, we have a million offer for Chalo, Granada. Yes, accept. Boom. Now we're going to get Schmilios and we're going to get uh, the Wonder Kid from Inter too. So we are going to be very, very tough team this season to beat. Uh, how many days? The one, two, three, like seven or eight days until the transfer window will close. Insecure jobs. Come on, let's check. Valerenga is insecure. Come on, let's see. Gio, 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 no? Ah. Still no. Deportivos Melpilla, Puebla, Ghana, Congo. Eight days until the transfer window will be closed. Come on, Shmilio, sign. We need a, another central defender, definitely. He will be a starter. This guy, Salvador, man. 24 years old. I know the uh, the tackling and the marking are not great. I don't care about the heading, to be honest. Tackling and marking are not great. Are just 12, but everything else. Hmm. If you remember the uh, the Argentinian central defender midfield uh, Mascherano from Barcelona, well, this the same type of player right here. Mascherano.
and we got him for free. Why? Wait, 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 wait. Adjust budget. Boom. Michael Rusillo, guys. Let's welcome our new Wonder Kid. Loan for one season. Michael Rusillo joined the club. Big, big signing. Now we are ready. Now, definitely no excuse if we're not going to finish in European spots. And I'm I'm telling you, I think we're gonna we're gonna finish top four now. Now we're looking top four. And we're gonna give these players I have three players, we're gonna give them faces. So we need some uh Oh my god dude this guy Michael Rusillo. Oh shit. What a player. All right, so he's going to be inside forward on the right. Attack. Damn. Let's give him a number. He wants seven, but we don't have seven available. Uh, let's give him 77. He wants seven. We're going to give him 77. There you go. And now let's give him face. It's going to take me a little bit, guys. Because I need to give three guys, actually, faces. We need to give... Uh, a bad face uh, to Olgun. Mm, maybe this guy too. Yeah, Olgun. Since I'm doing it, I'll do it for all. Oh, and registration though. We need registration. Registration. Rocio. Alright. Okay.
All right, I think we found him. Yeah, sorry guys, uh, it's gonna take me a little bit. I need to give three players faces here, so. We found the first one. Okay, Rocio. Let's see the other one, Carlos Abad. All right. This guy is gonna be easier. There's plenty of guys with short hair. Come on. And one more guy. Olgun. Same thing. Very quick. Yep. Done and done. And a bud. Finally. References. 
reload. All right, finally. Make up mm. your own rules as you go. Stay only true to what you know and who you are. A few minutes and the new faces are going to kick in and can, we can resume. The road may be rough, you might not see the top, but when it's don't quit and when it's don't stop. We have one more hour, guys. One more hour. I think we can play two more games, which is good. We can play... Uh, Saint Etienne and uh, Strasbourg. Not bad. We have a good chance to stay on top on the first place if we win both of these games. And we're waiting for Schmilios to agree and sign with us for another season on loan. So everybody is happy from what I'm seeing here. Every player is happy. I love it. I love it. All the green here is absolutely what I want. Check some of my free bets here. In the meantime, That strategy is going great, man. Unbelievable. Winning everything. Almost there.
All right. Finally. Took a little bit. Let's see the new faces. Michael Rossillo. Italian. 18 years old player from Inter on loan for the whole season. Wonder Kid. Our new inside forward, guys. On the right. A beast. Wow. 183 CM. Huge potential. My god. Carlos Sabad with a new face here. This guy is not gonna play too much, but. And all goon. Let's go. Now we're waiting for Schmilios to join and uh, for Chalo to sign with Girona, I think. Let's introduce to the team. Let's do a press conference for Rosillo. Big, big signing. And he is injured for how many days? Okay, tomorrow is going to come back. Good. Milios delayed. Yes, we will delay Schmilios for one week until we can sell Chalo. Chalo is going to Granada, actually, not Girona. Granada, guys. For one million. There you go. Boom. Good price. Oh, 50%? Come on. I forgot about it. Hmm. Whatever. Let's see, money-wise, how do we do? 380. Oh, yeah, we're good. We are good. I think it's gonna happen. Let's see how much money do we need for Milios. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So, we need... Let me see. How much do we need? What's the total... Contract. Sell on clause. Sell clause. Twenty three. Whatever. Who is this guy? Martin Fernandez. Ooh. He was our player? Oh. Whatever. I think it's gonna happen. So yeah. We're just waiting now for Schmilios to uh, to join guys and we're done with the summer deals. Great, great um, summer transfer window for us. We improved the squad a lot. Three wins in a row in the league. What more do you want? <laughs> Perfect start of the season. Uh, yeah, 10 meeting. 
skip, skip, and Brain knee ligaments, okay. Two more days, and we are gonna <coughs> play at home Saint Etienne. They are for fourth, mm, they have a good start, too. We need to be very careful. One hour and 34 minutes into the stream. Let's press continue. So Paris is first now. But if we win our game against Saint-Étienne, we're going to go back on top. Paris FC is a new promoted team. <laughs> Welcome back, Bessmurf. Quiet day, guys. I know everybody's busy. Playing uh, Saint Etienne. And then uh, the last game of the stream will be Strasbourg, guys. And then uh, we'll, we will come back with the betting league. But I'm so happy Rusillo signed with us. What a player. My God. Michael Rusillo. Is he Spanish? No, Italian. Only Italian. Okay. So because our scouting department, we found this wonder kid. I guess our scouts are not that bad. Yeah, it's okay, Bessmurf. Get some rest, man. Yeah, I'm tired too. I had a rough workout. Didn't sleep too good last night. But it's Friday, so... At least the weekend is starting. Ngezana... We'll go for the uh, national team duty <laughs> right after a Saint Etienne game.
Yeah, I understand Vesmurf, man. Yeah. I totally understand. That's why you should get some rest and whenever you can, you can join the stream whenever you don't feel like it. You know, it's all good, man. Rest is always good for, for you, for the body, you know. Also, going and training is always good, you know. Physical activity is good. God, Monaco beat five nothing at Lille. Yet, and we beat Monaco two one. Huh. All right, let's do the training levels. So, Bessmurf, I'm again 2-2 two two today with that strategy. I have two more pre-bets, so I'm telling you, you should try it whenever you, you feel like it, whenever you have a chance. It's hitting. Yeah, don't worry, dude. Like I said, man. First thing is your private life. This is just like, you know, to have fun, to relax, streaming, you know. And I understand just, you know, you got to do what you got to do. Me too, when I don't have time, you've seen me. I, I can't stream. Sometimes I can't stream two times a day. I have to stream only one time. So, so I totally understand, man. real life you know <laughs> what what can you do i hope you're going to feel better this guy negative yeah i really hope you're going to feel better <clears throat> just try to get some sleep if you're tired just don't worry about the stream you know you can re you know you can rewatch the stream if you want. It's all always on YouTube. Right after I finish, I always post it on YouTube, so so you don't have to worry about that. You know. All right, so let's check for additional additional training for each player. Yeah, I hope so, man. I hope so. But like like I told you before, it's very important to get rest. Be active. Don't stay all the time home, you know, because I used to do that. I used to stay a lot uh, home and it's not good for your brain, you know. You, you need to be outside, fresh air. You need to be active, you know, eat healthy. Hey, Bizarra, how are you, man? Welcome to the stream. I appreciate you stopping by. All right, so we are ready to play uh, Saint Etienne, guys. Let's uh, let me see here. Agboton, Lacoste. We're gonna add Olgun and Rusillo is gonna start, guys. Let's check this guy out. And the lion will be on the bench. I'm pretty good, man. Just um, just dealing here with some uh, with some league uh, shenanigans. <laughs> we are starting 
right now uh, our wonder kid we just signed him from inter milan on loan for the whole season michael russillo he looks insane oh yeah so you pretty much you pretty much uh, had this for the whole yeah 20 years now wow like i said man best Merv, just first you have to take care of the health first you know try to get as much rest as you can and staying late at night it's not good you know staying very late and lack of sleep is always a problem But yeah, let's move forward with the third, no, with the second game of the stream. We have a great start of the season, guys. In We are third in the league standings, but if we win this game, we're going to go back on top being first. So let's go. Let's see if we can beat at home saint Etienne. Yeah, he looks insane. 18 years old, on loan from Inter Milan for one season. And we have the the option to buy him for 9 million it's gonna be tough to to raise that money but let's hope let's hope man this is the second season in charge at bordeaux and this season it looks like we are gonna go to europe let's go guys Hey Marlboro, uh, yes, you can go to FM Scout uh, and they have it there, it's OPZ Elite. If you go to fmscout.com, you can find it there. And welcome to the stream. Yeah, I love it. I love it. That's why I cannot play the game without it. I always uh, try to wait until I start my main save. I wait for this uh, skin to be released, you know. So strong start of the of the game here. We're putting pressure on Saint Etienne. Oh, you're. Oh, I'm sorry, man. We're only speaking English here. I don't know Turkish. <laughs> Pixel. Ah, oh, big one-on-one -on -one chance. But uh, your English uh, looks fine to me. <laughs> Shmilius, I heard some rumors. Arsenal reached out to you yesterday after the disappointing loss in your body. Did you get a job? <laughs> uh, no, I didn't. So one nothing for Milios. Welcome to the stream, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry you lost that bet. I lost it too. I lost that pre bet with Arsenal. So one nothing for Saint Etienne, guys. The men more from the players. Let's see here. Ah, uh, defensive mistake, of course. Oh. Oh, I thought you had a, you had a bet on them. Yeah, I had a pre-bet to Arsenal to win and I lost it. But what a goal from Gonçalves, dude. Oh my god. How was that possible? From, so, from far away, man. Like, what a great goal. Let's see here. Pixel. Come on, they can make a mistake. Playing Pixel. Oh, yes. Yes, Pixel with the... With the equalizer. My god, what a goal. Pixel again. Four games, four goals. He is insane. Look at this. Big mistake by Tuye. Post. And then from the rebound, Pixel ties the game at 1 1. So, uh, let me see here. I don't know if you're joking or you're just... Uh, <laughs> you're uh, saying... You're saying uh, the, the truth, Marlboro. 
but again if you want i can type i can type for you the website where you can find uh, the skin is fmscout.com but let me see here and guys after the game i'm gonna have to make a phone call which will take me a few minutes all right fmscout.com click on that and Marlboro, that's gonna take you to um, to the website where you can find everything related to football manager man well he he's pretty fluent in writing <laughs> he was very fluent and Gazana with the corner kick And goal! Who scored? I was texting. Who scored? Let's hear. Ingezana corner kick and Salvador, the shortest central defender we got. 2-1. My god, what a start of the season. This is this would be the fourth win in a row. Rusillo Me Mehic. Uh, not a penalty, no. Aliu! Post! Oh my god. Salvador, thank you, Besmer. And Shmirios, we are negotiating a loan, uh, another loan for you now. Uh, in a few days, we're gonna have the confirmation. But yeah, another, another season for you on loan at Bordeaux, man. Yeah, uh, for some reason they accepted another offer. Like um, in June, when uh, we ended the season and uh, we, 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 when we tried to 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 uh, extend the loan, they said no. But now they said yes. So uh, kind of the same, but I don't care. I like the attribute, so definitely we're gonna play you as a starter. So. Definitely in the future you will grow. Aliu block shot. And uh, like I said, Gil Petroshan um they have a very bad start of the season. There's a slight chance I might I might go back. And if I do, I'll take you all with me. But Jill has a very good financial situation. So there's there's a good chance I can buy you all. <laughs> we can go to Jill. Alright, so Ronaldo 6.4. 2-1 at the break, guys. Not bad. Let's tell Pixel to stop tackling. Dressing room. Very good first half. Alright, so we have half an hour, guys. And uh, we have to end the stream. Ataturk forever. <laughs> Okay, no worries, man. Uh, we'll see you later, okay? Thank you for the picks for the uh, for the betting stream. And we'll talk to you later. Come on, guys. Come on. Not it, yellow.
Diego block shot there. Come on, Tom. Good job. Good job. Two one. We're still on top, but we have to be careful. Ronaldo there is not having a good game. Yeah, six three. We're gonna take out Ronaldo. One of those days, you know. Can have every game perfect game. And Mateo on send six fifty. All right. Becky Tom. Calfrié. And steal for Herman. Herman! Boom! There you go. There you go. This is how you come back on top, guys. The Terminator. Herman the Terminator. This is his new nickname. What a goal. He waited for the mistake, stole it, and then executed the goalie. 3-1, guys. We're going to secure the three points here in front of the fans with a huge, huge win again. Not it. With a pass for Pixel. One-on-one -on -one with the goalie. And he tried to chip the goalie. Pixel with a fancy, fancy uh, finish there. Betsmurf, I will start uh, the the betting stream at 2.30, man. Mehic! Mehic! Oh, come on, man. It's so close. Just put it in, dude. Hey, Argentina. How are you, man? Welcome to the stream. And another one Becky Tom 4-1 what is happening here I'm doing FM 23 Lv Lvov save with Estonia oh nice nice first season well I hope you're enjoying I hope you're enjoying your save man that's a fun uh, fun save right Third game. 4 1 here, guys. Oh my god. We are putting so much pressure on uh, Saint Etienne. No, let. <laughs> five? Five goals? How many? Thank you for uh, following also, Argentina. I'm guessing he scored five like Holland. And big save by Sonsen here. He scored four goals. Oh my god. 4-1. So probably your striker is a, a wonder kid. <laughs> Nice, man. Great job. Keep it going. Aliou. 70th minute. You lost 2-1 first game. Well, <clears throat> it's probably because it's just the, uh, the beginning of the season until your tactic is going to start to blend it with the team, you know. Give it more time. And a chance here for Saint Etienne and Sonsen again with a save. Let's do more subs here. Uh, Peter Brown for Becky Tom. Ukraine has longer. Yeah, yeah, I know. Let's do Lacoste for Nare. But yeah, that's a fun save, man. 
uh, Joshua Aliu. Mm, yeah, we'll put Hatling in. And Perez for Ngezana. Let's rest some key players here because we pretty much won this game. We don't want to injure anybody. Dynamo Kiev now. Oh, that's a that's a very very tough one, man. Good luck. <laughs> Shakhtar and Dynamo Kiev are always always hard to beat at their stadium. Oh. If you get a tie there, then you should be happy. Argentina, you should be happy, man. <laughs> Nare with the cross. Ah. And Mehic. Header over the, over the bar. Unexpected start of the season, guys. Four games, four, four wins. Two points ahead of Paris Saint-Germain. <laughs> we know we're not going to win the league. But definitely, we're going to finish top six. Doctor are struggling, but if we get a win. And another save by Sansan, dude. Yeah, Shakhtar is struggling in real life too. They lost yesterday 7-1 to Feyenoord, so. <laughs> and anything can happen, Argentina. Anything can happen, man. Oh yeah, this is the... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a long season best Murf, but we're looking great man and a huge win here guys 4-1 in front of uh, our own fans at Manmut Atlantic Pixel Salvador Herman and Becky Tam on the score sheet huge three points my god can't believe it the dream is still is still on <laughs> We are like Arsenal this season. Keep dreaming. <laughs> My god. We have uh, Stras Strasbourg next, guys. But uh, please give me a few minutes. I have to make a phone call and I'll be right back.
all right guys i am back i had to make a phone call all right so we won against Saint Etienne. four wins in a row let's do the press conference here and uh we have 17 minutes left from the stream and definitely we're not gonna have time to play uh Strat strasbourg guys there is a 14 days uh, break between the games and definitely there's no time because it's already 143 and at two o'clock uh, central time i have to um to log off and then come back with a betting stream at 2 30 or nothing defeat oh i'm sorry argentina i'm sorry man but like i said the season is long and you can come back and best murph uh, i will see you later man sorry I, I just saw your message all right so we're gonna keep pressing continue until we uh finalize the uh Schmilio's deal and then uh we're gonna log off tent isn't bad yeah i agree with you it's not bad at all and like i said uh, you have a long season ahead of you with few adjustments you know maybe in the winter you can get more players not bad uh i think it's carpati lvov right that's your team carpati lvov Yeah, you need to, uh, right now, uh, <clears throat> next game, if you play at home, you need to grab that win, you know, so you can uh, improve the mood uh, inside your squad, you know. The morale is very important. So we have uh, Ronaldo suspended. Alexandria, yeah. I never coached in um, in in Ukraine. It's interesting. It's fun because you have to like fight against Shakhtar and Dynamo Kiev every season, you know. Ten versus third. Okay. Alexandria. Yeah, Alexandria is not a bad team also. I know them from real life. So we have uh, three more days until the end of the transfer window. Come on, let's let's finish that deal with Schmilios. And we can save the game and uh, end the stream, guys. Shakhtar are 6th or 5th in my save right now. Okay. Well, definitely by the end of the season, they're going to go up there like 1st or 2nd. They always do that. Um, maybe you are going to beat them. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> well yeah probably it's gonna be you dynamo kiev and shakhtar top three
Like I said, with few adjustments, definitely can finish top three. How are your finances? Do you still have money for transfers? Oh, they're last in the league. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, but you can take them. You can take them top three. I think it's the old Carpati Lvov. If I'm not mistaken. Maybe maybe I'm wrong. But I know it's Carpati Lvov. With their old name now. Probably they changed their name. Alright, so we're 31st August, guys. 31st August 2033. Our 12th season ongoing now. We're looking to sign Schmilio's on loan. The last signing of the of the uh, the first transfer window. And in the winter, we're gonna look to ask the board for more money. Hopefully. We're gonna make uh, more transfers. Let's see here. Hmm, won't be discussing transfers today. One hundred ninety-five K. Oh, okay. I mean, uh, yeah, it's not a lot. Maybe you can do some loans with that money. You know. All right. So we have um, two offers for Casado. We both we're gonna both uh, reject both of them. This is our backup goalie. We can't. We can't sell him. Next transfer window. How about that? We're not going to disclose any more of our plans. Come on. Need to sign Schmilios. We will come back tomorrow, guys, with more FM. Definitely um, in the morning, we will uh, continue this save. Uh, I'll let you know on Discord, maybe, uh, but it's always before 12 p.m. Uh, Central Time, so my uh, schedule is kind of weird, so I can't say exactly at what time I'm going to start streaming, but if you're following me on Twitch and Discord, you're going to get notified when whenever I'm online. Tomorrow we're going to have both uh, the betting league and football manager. So it's going to be a full day.
11 days until we are gonna travel to play Strasbourg. They are currently 14th in the league, so it's a very, very good chance for us to get another three points. Let's see here if we can finish the deal with Schmilios. Yes, we can adjust budget and boom, Schmilios is back at the club, guys. Huge, huge uh, signing for us. We, we needed so bad Schmilios in our defense. I'm very, very happy. All right, um, as soon as we're going to put him on training, we're going to save the game and uh, we're going to end the stream, guys. We had uh, fun for 2 hours and 15 today. We played two games. We beat Socho, we beat Saint-Étienne. We're still first in Ligue 1, surprisingly, in our second season in charge at Bordeaux. And tomorrow we will come back, guys. Not sure what number I'm going to give to Schmilios. Okay, probably... 22, 24, 26, I don't know. I don't know what number is available anymore. Yeah, it's always uh, it's always uh, processing slower in uh, this kind of transfer windows. Like the summer transfer window is the slowest one. There you go. All right, so let's put Shmilios on training. Defend. Let's register him. There you go. And let's give him a number. Milios will get number, let's see here, 26. Number 26. Submit. Let's check his skills. Yep, it's still good, guys. Left, left footed central defender, exactly what we need. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let's check our finances right now. We are on positive. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. All right, guys. That's it for today. Thank you so much for being here. Argentina, thank you for following, man. And I hope you're going to come back and then uh, we're going to have more fun playing football manager. Um, thank you, Betsmer. Thank you, Schmilios. Thank you, uh, Pixel, for joining today again. I will see you later, guys. Enjoy the rest of the day. Take care. Bye-bye.